Trouble navigator. Ah, I have an import. Trouble navigator right here, and then just pass it right here, and okay, and then I say tap like this, and just put the screen to um, our tab, and our tab now is the um, tab bar, but it hold all of this as well, and. Oh, I need to replace the tab with the, the much uh, much navigators right and uh, run it boom it shows us the same and you can also try from the uh, left right as you can see nice Okay guys, and now it's time to show the navigation on the top and we, we will have a button to click to show the drawer and then we will custom the drawer by um, uh, a script and we link it to a script and then we can um, design anything we want in um, the script to show on the drawer screen right here, okay? Um, as some um, previous um, previous um, thing that we do is um, uh, to 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 uh, to 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 to, to enable this um, navigation, we have to cut the screen to a uh, uh, tab. Uh, sorry, to stake navigator. And now I have I need to create. Um, I can call it home because it icon is home. Is equal to stake navigator, yeah, then boom, right here, and then we cut this screen one to this, okay, and we sh should have um, at least two to show you it's home, and the second one is um, I can say favorite, yeah, favorite. Home and I change it to favorite, favorite, right here and uh, replace with the, the name of um, the variable home and favorite. And in the tab bar, we back to the tab bar and we can say um, um, home is equal to home. Or you can make sure that. Uh, um, tap home we can say that to make sure not to confuse is equal to this and um, tap favorite is equal to uh, favorite is the tab of is the state of the screen favorite and now can we run it yes as you can see that is uh, what we have done before yes that is right um, uh, right here you can change um, the, 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 the text we just say um, title like this is home you can test that boom it's home and it's also home and you can change this and this separately it is okay and now we test on Android, but as you can see, and uh, there is something wrong uh, on um, Android. As you can see, this is the uh, navigation, but it is on um, um it is below the tab bar. Why, bro? <laughs> uh, it is really easy to fix. We have to cut. We we have to uh, make a. Uh, a stake, one more stake, and we call um, um, stake home. It is a little bit tricky, but it is okay. I can say um, stake tab, not stake home. Sorry, stake tab is equal to stake navigator, like this. And then I will say it. It is just the name, and then it is equal to this. 
right? And then in the stake, stake uh, tab, I replace with stake now. And you will see um, two navigation right here. Yes, <laughs> it is so weird, right? Uh, it is ha it has two navigations right now so we gonna hide this um, below navigation and we keep the top one because um, it's so um, so wrong right it should be only the top and the, the tab right here and then it is um, an but but um, it show you um, on below the tab so we have to cheat uh the navigation that we have one more st um, stake and then it will show up on um, the top right and then we hide the bottom ones as well mm -hmm. to hide that we have just to go to um, the each stake uh each stake of from um, the screen and we can we have to say hey the mode is uh, and we pass none to head the mode and then it will hide the head the mode as well and then it leave um, only um, it will hide the header mode yeah the header mode off from the screen but it keep um, the 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 stake tab so it should be on the top right here nice as you can see I don't um, set title on this but I just want to show you on this. Ah, this is what we want, right? We can swap to show, but um, for now we have an improvement. Um, the travel screen by um, ourselves yet. We just use the default. Uh -huh. And I refresh the um, iOS simulator, and the result will be the same. Boom! As you can see. It is really nice yes okay guy and now it's time to um, implement our own screen of um, Trova Trova yeah of Trova we can um, design anything and then we put the screen dot JS inside the Trova right it is the default one and we will implement the custom one we have to create a screen for drawer screen js and it is a screen a normal screen so we have a, um, extend from class as well right this is a react native i would like um, a few components like a um, view text or buttons right here yeah and we export the default directly right here let me say um, draw screen extend extend from react native component right here like this and we have some um, render right and in render we return um, something like a we have a view why not hmm? and we have some text on or not it's like um, mm, I want to say I am here like this and we should have um, a buttons right here right why not because we can custom anything we want because it's just a normal screen but we will put it in um, our Java screen right why not um, I can say uh, hello bro mm -hmm. and it is a screen a normal screen right to do that in uh, Java First, we have to import the screen first from where is that? It should be from yeah, drawer, drawer screen like this. You can say drawer screen. 
good. And then in um, the drawer, the main drawer that we export the phone, we have to change um, config. Yeah, we have to add a config that um, we have um, uh, the content. We have the, the, the screen that we will put it as our content. So we say content component and then it will return a um, prop to, to that props and then we have to um, we have to call the, the screen driver we, we pass the uh, driver screen to that and we will pass um, our uh, props that we receive to the, the screen driver as well yes and now we can paste that boom and what is wrong no it is about a button and now we drag and we can see the text on the top and the button right here right and if you want to change something um, inside the, the drawer screen you have just to go to drawer screen right it is our custom ones that we can use anything inside this um, screen this drawer screen right um, now I would have um, a view right why not and I will style it uh, put it some um, height equal to a hundred and background color is red to let you see um, uh, what yeah as you can see this is our custom ones that we implement that we have just created and now you can um, uh, render any component you want inside the screen right and the next step it should be um, the icon right here click on the icon to show the drawer right here like this okay and before we implement that we um, I think we should change um, the header um, the navigation color to fit to the tab bar because it looks so a little bit awful right um, here and to change that color uh, some previous um, previous section right in home we have to post header style like this and the background color would be the same as um, the tab bar color and it is the default of tab bar color but now I want to change to um, the color to roja blue and the header um, hint color to white the tag color to white and now can we test it boom it is a uh, we we change that we can um, change that now but um, there is some something wrong right here we have header tin color tin not tin tin t and again the tag will be um, white right here and I want to change the tab tab bar yeah tab bar color because as you can see it is a um, awful right it is not good so to change that we have to go to um, the tab now right here and right here we have to change that by um, uh, we can say star yeah star and we pass a JSON we can say background color is equal to royal blue 2 and let us see what happened boom that is really nice as you can see it is um, the same on my application as you can see ah, it is iOS right I will open my application right here. Mm, I am running uh, 